Okay, this morning I'm going to show you how to debone a, a northern pike. Uh, completely fillet it until you have your end result just like this. Okay, a lot of people don't like northern pike because they don't know how to clean them properly and don't know how to take the wide bones out, so everything that they call them trash fish, but they're actually a very good fish. Okay, the first thing I do with the pike is I fillet it. And I start by going right in behind the gill here. There's the rib cage on this side. I take the inside ribs out. There's your. That's what you have to leave on for the department so they can distinguish the species of fish between a northern, a pike, a walleye, or whatever. Doing them this way, you have very little waste. You're right down to the bone on both sides. No waste at all. Okay, take the good cage off on the other side. Right on. Okay. Now I just trim them up a little bit here. A little bit of backbone in here. Like that. front off a little bit. Okay. Now, I always, the way I was taught many, many years ago, I laid a fish, belly of the fish to your belly, belly to belly. Now, right, run this down here. Here's a row. That's the top layer of the Y on the Y bone on the fish. So I run my blade straight down across the top, right down till I feel that bone. Okay, just like that. You can actually see hear it right there. Now you taper this off. You don't cut it all the way off because according to the regulations, one fish consists of two pieces of fish. Okay, they were right there. I just opened that up like so. Now there's an off, there's a natural center line in the pike right, right through here. You just go in along that, make a little mark, and I always go from right to left because I'm make the mark and then I go in here from the right hand side, go in underneath and roll your blade up underneath this wide bone. In down and always do short motions, don't take long strokes, just short little cutting strokes and then you make a nice even job. That's all, that's your waist right there, that's all your wide bone, the Y and the fork or whatever, it's all right in there. The other side, the same thing, I just clean it up, trim it up, make it look presentable. And now, this one here, you can see that top of that Y bone. That's actually part of the rib cage that's cut off. Now I just run the blade right along the top of that, down to the end here. It doesn't go all the way to the tail, it just, and then I just feather this back. Now you can, that's your, that's the handle, I call it the handle of your Y bone right there. You can basically pretty much see it in there. Now I make my the natural line through here. And again, I always start at the right hand side, if you're right handed. And then in underneath, roll your blade up. Go in underneath the, roll up. In underneath, roll up. In underneath, roll up. One completely deep on northern pike. 